everybody, welcome back to Alien Isolation, and let's, uh, we are at a point here where we have to get back to the San Cristobal Medical Center, which I can't remember which one of these it is. Will this thing tell me? Um, but we think we might be able to get comms back up and running, so hopefully we can do that. Get to the San Cristobal, it doesn't say which one's which, though. Uh, uh, is that the Psymed Tower? <laughs> I don't know. Solomon's Habitation Tower. Lorenz Sistex Fire. I think it's the Psymed. I think it's Science and Medical. That makes sense to me. Hey, if I have to guess, I'm at least going to guess somewhat. It, well, I don't know. System misuse and passenger inebriation will be reported to the Colonial Marshals. Okay, thanks. Well, I'm not inebriated, I'm nor, nor would I want to be here, but afterwards, yeah, for like a month. Wouldn't even want to think about what's going on here. If I live, we'll see if I live or not. Anything on the scope? Nope, we're good. Excuse me, can you just let me on board here before the aliens come and get my giblets? My giblets are very important to me. Plunk. Open sesame. Works for me. Alright, let's see. Yes, medical tower. Simon. I'm hoping I guessed right here for the St. Cristobal Medical Center. Carter, I'm at medical. Yep, I did. Did you manage to get to comms? I'm here, but I was too late. Apollo's recovered from the reactor purge and knocked out external comms again. Oh, well, great. So why'd you send me here? Plan B, Rick. See, before I left, the system showed a ship approaching Sebastopol. I think it's the Inisadora. Marlow managed to send out his auto codes to call it in while comms were temporarily open. We've got to get to it. Is it docking? No, but it's in a holding position nearby. Head for the ambulance bay. The shuttles are really short range, but they'll make it. Got it. Cool. I'm gonna go ahead and save, even if there are hostels nearby. Is that the alien? What the hell was that? Yeah, that's not a, not a good sound that I want to hear. Okay. Hang on. Uh, which way do I gotta go? Uh. Okay, so I'm, I'm going the wrong, I'm facing the entirely wrong way. San Cristobal Medical Center, find a short-range ambulance. Right. Okay, so we're just going to go this way. I'm not going to let anything bother me here. Alright, as long as I do this nice and slow, I should be alright. shouldn't have too many troubles. Whatever it is behind me is still behind me. I think that's a working Joe. He's moving real slow. I do hear the aliens bumping about, which, now that there's more than one, supposedly there was only ever one, but now that there's confirmed more than one, I bet you they'll be even more active than before, so. Hang on. Why did I go this way? Because I couldn't go the other way. Should I go this way, though? Staff entrance. That's real confusing. Hang on, let me make sure that there's no way into this. Oh, there is. Okay, I can just cut my way open. Ta-da! I'm glad I saw that. Ooh, and it's fast, too. Oh, yeah. I'll take it. Hold the trigger. Down. Boom. Okay, nothing's moving now. But I bet you it will absolutely not be this easy. I'm going the long way around because I see that vent up there, and I am not about to die. Crap, I can't go this way. I gotta go right by the vent. Shoot. You stay up in there. Don't you come down and try to visit me. Boot boot don't want nothing to do with you. Alright. Primary care floor. Oh, this is place is still on fire. <laughs> this is where I get that explosion at, but this is still on fire. Oh well, that's good. Uh, Okay, so I gotta go out and around. Oh, I was hoping I'd never have to come back to this freaking place. This is the place I spent three hours at. And it was just awful. Ooh, that guy got chest bursted for sure. So they've been back it's through here. Really number on this place. Okay, should I go through laundry or should I go through here? I go through here. Ugh. I hate this place. I hate it so much. Yet it seems like so long ago that I was here. I mean, IRL, that was actually like three weeks ago, I think, that I've played. I've been playing this on and off for quite a while. Alright. I don't really see anybody, so that's good. Is this, uh. 
super closed or not? Or locked, okay. As long as I move deliberately here, I'm okay not to have to crouch. Yeah, I think we're all right. That is, but I'm not stopping. It's probably working, Joe. way, but it says that door is closed. Or did I just turn... Did I just turn around and take a complete U-turn from where I was? Yeah, it. I did, because I'm a big dummy. Oh, good. It distracted him. Oh, I'll take it. Alright, cool. Bring my throwing flame throw around again. I guess that uh, disturbance brought him out. Okay, they're gonna. There he goes. So I really do need to avoid them. Because I don't want to ask you about Sebastopol's safety protocols. Whole lot going on here. All right, that's Alien. So he's moving fast. I wonder if I can throw a noisemaker and distract them both. Talking to this stupid gurney. Alright, he's not really going anywhere. I'm gonna go through the same path he had before. Okay, well, I'm just gonna go ahead and waste a noisemaker. Oh, you. Oh, wow, that thing bounced like nobody's business. Alright, let's see if that affects both of them. Nope. Seem to have. Maybe I threw it too far. Well, he's really con concentrating on it, though. There he goes. Oh, he's mad. Right, what are you doing, buddy? Maybe if I. safe with my flamethrower, too. Come on, walk through. There he goes. Man, these guys are slow. You think? I don't really want to use flames anywhere, but, you know, you leave me no choice sometimes. What can I say? I'm a bit of a pyro. Yes, yes it was. Alright, gotta scoot through here nice and slow. Glad I finally got past him, jeez. I don't see any more than I heard the alien a second ago.
Who are you talking to? Yeah, hazard containment breach, you think? Alright, my good old hiding spot right here. Right under this thing. I remember this spot well. I probably should go save. Let's see, he won't see me under this. Nope. If he does, I'm gonna flame him. Although it is a lot more lit up in here than it used to be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're sniffing around. You're trying to find stuff. Keep walking. Okay, good. He left. Okay, he's, he's in the... He's in the, the vents. Alright. Yeah, we got this. We got this. It's no big deal. It's NBD, guys. NBD. Yeah. Making my way to the ambulance bay. Oh. Okay. Um... It just says find one, it doesn't say where. Flashbang. New flashbang. Damn, the my access tuner isn't powerful enough. I'm gonna have to go back down, aren't I? Morgan, concerned, there has to be a way. Yeah, this place is awful. It's creepy. It's creepy. Creepy. Level 3 upgrade for access tuner. Crap, I bet you that's on the other side, isn't it? Oh, actually, surprisingly not. It still says here. Hmm. Box or something. Make sure I keep an eye on this. Let's see, there's another door here. Can't get through either of those. That's nothing. What is with that sound? That's an awful, awful sound. Boo's Boo don't want to hear that sound because it sounds awful. What's this? Oh, how convenient. <laughs> Hey, at least I don't have to go anywhere. I'll, I'll take that. Uh, is that easy? Okay. Make sure that nobody's out of run away. Alright, what do you got for me? It's the same as always. And then check your flag, and then your key, and then weird L shaped thing, and then that guy. I don't know what I'm just. That's what they are. Yep. Uh, what about you? Is he gonna is he gonna answer or not? What about him? Launch the shuttle. Just go already. Why does this have just bad idea written all over it? to a place where aliens are. <laughs> All right. Docked with the Anisadora, I, uh, I presume? Ricardo, can you hear me? This place is a dump. I mean, I know that the other place was pretty wrecked up too, but man, this place is a dump. Oh. Go ahead and save this. I have to explore the Anisadora. Why do I get the sense that this place is probably just as screwed as the other one? It's a big handle. Um, nothing on the motion tracker, but Marlo should have been should have been here, shouldn't he? I'm just gonna move through until I find something. Oh look! I think we may have broken our losing streak. We've barely been scraping a living the past couple of years, and the Anisadora is starting to look like the wrecks we salvage. You think? Can't say the crew's been faring any better. Then we found that flight recorder. It belongs to a ship, the Nostromo, Wayland Utani property. That means there'll be a reward. But then Marlo had an even better idea. 
Extrapolate the path of the flight recorder to try to find the wreck of the Nostromo. We got lucky. Found a distress signal, and now we're following it. This is it. I can feel it in my bones. Can you? He always said he'd do right by me. Something tells me that was the chick that got the chest burster. Just saying. I don't I don't think it said a name, but I'll have to try to check. Signal detected. Marlo. Heist says he's just picked up some kind of signal. We've got Lewis trying to dis decode it now. Could be the Nostromo. Want to come up and see for yourself? Sure. Technician's report. 10-24-21-37. Marlo. Just had to do some much-needed work on the sublight engines. The old girl was complaining so loudly I'm surprised something didn't fall off during the last jump. Everything's holding together now, but she'll need a full overhaul soon, and not just for the core systems. We keep pushing her like this, and we're gonna end up being like the only salvage. We're gonna end up being the only salvage crew hitchhiking through deep space. <laughs> yeah, that sounds about right. It's gonna be an expensive job, so let's hope you you're right about that beacon. Could could be our last chance for a decent paycheck. Anyway, I, re I had to reset the door key code afterwards. The new one is forty five ten, Lewis. Okay, error. Ooh, there we go. We're outside Sebastopol. Milo and Foster woke up first. She looked terrible. Meeks and me are about to take a shuttle to the station. But well, this has got to break quarantine oh, procedures, what right? Is that again? It's Milo's ship. She's Milo's wife. And things got heated. And Meeks got a bloody nose. So, I don't know. Maybe the doctors will give her the all clear and things can get to normal. But if they sniff it out when we get on board, I don't want any part of it. Marlo doesn't pay nearly enough for that kind of noise. Interesting. So it was his wife that did it. Okay. Or that got the... She didn't do it, she got it. Go check, but that sucks. So glad that I can hack stuff. Oh, on the first try. Yeah. Hack the planet. That was a silly movie. Am I supposed to go the door? Watch, I'm gonna turn the corners and get freaky. Hey, buddy, how you doing? Yeah, I did it. Ricardo, in case you're here, man. Got the Unisodora's basic power systems back online. Doors should be open. Hopefully some light. Still no sign of Marlo. Is this... I think that's where I just came from. Hey, Ripley. Yes, Welcome to the Unisodora. Oh, good. Marlo? Where are you, Marlo? Thanks for switching the power back on. You saved me a job. I only needed it online temporarily. I had some things to fix. Oh, good thing he fixed them. I'm like they're shocked the hell out of him. Find Marlo. Oh, this dude, this dude's creepy. Why wouldn't you be like, oh, hey, glad we're both alive, blah, 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 you know. Uh, where am I going? Uh, I guess, yeah, okay. Yeah, I'm going the right way. I gotta go back to where I came, and there was a little cutout there for, there was a door, I guess, that led off to my left, I'm assuming. Yeah, this one. Maybe oh. you want to join my crew. Plenty of free spots. That's because you got most of them killed. Mom had double crossed me. He said he'd give me a limit if he handled the creature so I could take it to the company, but he... Taylor? Taylor! Marlo, what are you doing? What no one else seems prepared to do. Come find me, Ripley. I got something for you. Yeah, it seems like you do. Why was there a face hugger on board? Seriously, what, what the hell is that doing here? I knew it. I knew this was too good to be true. Uh... Let's turn that off. I thought that was something else. Alright, hang on. Check this terminal. Oh, seriously, why are there why are there freaking aliens on board? I thought she didn't burst until afterwards. Sevestopol, log 543374. Whatever it was that atta attached itself to Foster is dead. 
I found it on the floor by her bed, all curled up like a spider. Foster said she felt fine, but I insisted on putting her into hypersleep. That thing must have done something to her, but maybe I can slow the process. Sevestopol's near the nearest station, so I'm going to get her checked out. Quarantine will be a problem, but I figured the Nostromo flight recorder may be the ticket. Whatever we have to do. Anisa Dora, this is Marshal Waits of Sevastopol. Officially, I should deny your request to dock. You should have. Sevastopol is currently being decommissioned, and I can't compromise security for unscheduled vessels. However, in the light of the property you found, I will allow a small number of your crew to dock via a short-range shuttle. I must remind you that Sevastopol is entitled to a cut of any reward for return of said property once it's on station. Let me know your decision. Wait's up. Jeez. So, yeah, Wait should have never done that. That that killed so many people. But, like I said, Wailing Yutani uses money to get whatever they want. Actually, I've never said that. But I just said it now. Wailing Yutani does use his money to get whatever they want. It's absolutely true, too. They are notorious for that crap. Oh, they killed so many people, too. That just seems to be their... their uh, as many people as they can kill and pay off and whatever to get this specimen. You'd think after a while they would just know not to try it. Just saying. Oh, why is the place shaking? I tried to save Foster. Brought him to Sebastopol. We'll call him. We're getting her ashore. That was yeah. stupid, Evie. Stupid. You don't beat this thing, Ripley. You can't. All you can do is refuse to engage. You gotta wipe out every trace, destroy any clue, stop its infection from spreading, make sure there's no chance of the human race ever making contact with it again. Because the moment it makes contact, it's one. The yeah. company's never gonna know what happened here. Nobody is. I won't allow it. Ah, uh, you know what? I like what he's talking about here. Because this thing, I completely agree, you can't win against it. Absolutely. Oh man, this is getting, this is getting deep. Well, it was getting deep anyways, but... Why is this place so dusty? I guess I've only seen one face hugger so far. And oh, it's drippy in here too. Why is everything in space so drippy? Um I forget what I was saying. Why 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 did I only see one face hugger so far? And first of all, why was that face hugger even out and about? I thought they only had a very limited lifespan once they came out of their egg, so you'd think it would uh Stay in its egg until it actually sent somebody, but then again, maybe it sent Taylor or Marlo and popped out, and then uh, it didn't have anywhere to go, so it wandered around. I don't know, man. I don't know, but this is getting super heavy. Power cord, okay. Use the terminal. No power. Flat cord data. Okay, let's do this. Clickety, clickety, clackety. Oh. Oh, this is... Oh, sweet. Added report. Personal message. This is... For my daughter. Oh, no. Hi, Amanda. I'm recording this for you. My sweetheart. And I hope you get to hear it one day. You see, I, um... I got into trouble. Um, my ship... There was an accident, sweetheart, and um, we found an alien creature. It was very dangerous. And the only way we could stop it was to destroy the ship. Uh, I'm okay. I'm stuck on this lifeboat, long way out. But we had to destroy the ship. We had to destroy the Nostromo. We just couldn't risk bringing that thing home with us. Gee, think. I needed to protect you. Don't worry. Don't worry about me. I'm sure I'll see you very soon. Yeah. I love you, sweetheart. Unfortunately, she does not see her again. Man, that's heavy. At least Amanda got to hear it, though. Oh my god. Oh, hi. Where did you come from? Now you understand. 
That seems like some crappy voice acting right there. Point the gun, don't say anything. That'll turn the reactor into a goddamn nuke. You'll destroy the ship and the station. It'll annihilate every trace of that creature. Ripley, it's the only way. I can't let it live. And I'm not letting the company have it, or they'll just start the whole thing over again. Yeah, that's true. Um, I wouldn't turn your back. Listen to me! We don't have to do this! Don't! Don't make mono! Marlo, please. You heard what your mother did. She understood. If she was here, she'd be helping me. You think she would want company suits on the zip code of that creature? No one must know. He's got a point. He does have a point. There are still people alive on the station. Marlo! Foster's not. She was my wife. I loved her. And I killed her. Oh. Ooh. I'll stop the overload. You have to help me. Go to that console. Uh, Warning. Fusion reactor overload in progress. Oh, she would be so Open the fusion system right so I can work on him. What? I need power sent to the auxiliary generator. Look for the letters A-U-X. Ox. I found it! Is that the best thing that this thing? Okay. And the buttons do quickly, quickly. We're all getting... Big button, okay? Okay, you're doing good, Taylor. Now switch the maintenance terminal from auto to manual. Do you see it? Can she see it? It'll be there, Taylor. Trust me. That's it. Okay, connect the terminal. Oh, that's a long one. Okay, that's what she said. Oop, wrong way, wrong way. There we go. Got it. Yay. Okay. Deactivate. Bump, bump. Wrench. I'll keep this wrench for life, man. Can we turn it off? So, did he die or what? You did it! Survivors. 
I'll leave this channel open. Torrent's out. Yeah, this is probably gonna kill you guys too. We're all gonna die. Except for probably Ripley somehow. That's that's how it goes usually. Use lever. Okay. Oh, poor poor Ripley. She has such crap to deal with. Welcome to Seeks and Communication. Uh, find Ricardo. Wait. Please. How the hell do I get over there? Sign in at reception. Oh wow, there's a lot of like, dead androids and stuff. Oh, he got shotgun shells. Oh, I hear somebody talking. I don't hear a save point though, because they're really, really oh, company. Season security just came through. Guns in hand, not friendly. I had to hide under a desk. What do they want? The Torrens. They heard the broadcast. They want to contact it. I think they plan on taking it by force. Can they? No. Guns are still out. Stay clear of them, though. They're dangerous and desperate. Oh, uh, yeah. Seriously. Well, I could do this, like, super sneaky, or I could blast them, or, like, bomb them and then run around, because I think I have to go all the way around here and then through this. It'd be really nice if there was a save point here. Is that? Oh, it's not a save point there, but I'd be able to make that work. Are you holding up? You okay? Oh. Alright, what do you got? I have the option of, I do have the option of blasting it for sure. This is not gonna work. I've seen you and I'm. <coughs> yeah, that's my thought. Bye! Yeah, that's what's going on. Ow, 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 ow. Oh crap! Take him out! That's what I thought. There is no way I was getting through that. Hmm, we are actually going to have to end the episode here. Uh, very interesting. So the thing that we just came back on, the little ambulance, is is screwed. We've been blown, blown up. Or not blown up. It's just damaged beyond use. We have to go and get on the Torrens somehow, some way. Which I'm sure is going to be oh so much fun. I'm just so glad to be back at Sylvester Paul. Either way, stick around, stay tuned. We will see y'all in the next one. Hopefully we can actually, like I said, make it off this rock. Well, not really rock. Space station. You get it. We'll see you all in the next one.